I'm going to show you the different field of view in your GoPro. I have the GoPro Hero 7 block here. And the first thing that you do is you turn on your GoPro by pressing this button here at the side. So we have here the 1080p, then the 60 frames per second, and then the S4 is upper wide. So you click that button and then you will go to this uh, interface here. We have the video settings interface and you have the 1080p 60 frames per second super view and the fov and under address of super view and then low light for auto stabilization it's also auto click the super view then you will have this wide and super view but you click the wide you click it again and you will have three options now you have linear wide and the super view so we will go to the super view because that will be the one that we will be using and you go back and then you can now press the record button you can also control your GoPro using your GoPro app and then you can click the control your GoPro button then after that you click the settings button at the bottom right of your cell phone there's a gear symbol click it and then you will can go to your uh, settings then you just locate the field of view options and then you can choose between the three field of view options from there right now we have the linear field of view that is the narrowest field of view that this GoPro is offering. I have a GoPro Hero 7 right now. So to uh, visualize it, you need to. I want you to take a look at this side mirror here and this uh, dashboard, and also the shape of the road and the horizon. Right, let's go. So this is my the road of my barangay here. This is a very very narrow road. When two cars met each other, one has to stop. And uh, the other car needs to go very very slow so that it will not hurt each other. The uh, the rumor has it that uh, they need to share the budget to other barangays so that uh, it's not only your barangay that will have the uh, concrete road. We will stop here for a moment and then I will adjust, change the adjustment. Take a look at the uh, side mirror now so that you can see the difference there. This area here are rice lands before the, the two houses that we have just passed by was uh, built uh, last year and the uh, amount of uh, water here for these rice fields uh, becomes scarce because of the development in the other areas nearby. See that bird that is the uh, little egret. So we will stop here because we already I uh, already showed you the uh, wide wide. So we will now stop here and I'm going to show you the uh, super wide. So this is the uh, super view. And you can see that the uh, angle here are very very wide here and it, ga it gets narrower to the uh, horizon of the of the frame and you can see that like you can now see this uh, speedometer here and okay let's go to the road so that you can uh, compare the result
let's get some gas uh, just uh, one letter just one letter of gas station just uh, about 500 meters from here so I hope you can see the difference now between the field of view this uh, GoPro I really uh, avoided this overview for a while. I uh, really wanted to have the uh, lanyard fail the view because uh, I wanted to avoid the distortion. The distortion. If you look at it closely, eh, there is a distortion at the edge of the frame, uh, right and left side of the frame. The bend starts at the uh, middle part. So if you have a super wide lens, uh, the uh, always remember that the center of the frame, horizontally, the center horizontally of the frame is uh, straight, and then as it goes uh, outwards from the center, uh, the uh, the distortion. Uh, gets wider uh, there is a bend in the image so yesterday I actually changed the uh, fly, fly ball of this uh, motorcycle and 